Now, in addition to China and the U.S., there are also confirmed cases of the coronavirus in Japan, South Korea, Thailand. Uh, travelers heading to the United States on direct or connect... Coronavirus? What is coronavirus? This is a very large outbreak. This is Dr. Bill Schaffner. I'm an infectious disease specialist and public health person. Coronaviruses are a whole family of viruses. Uh, for the most part, they don't cause any real uh, clinical illness except the occasional cold. But you know, from time to time, there's a rogue coronavirus that develops. We remember SARS 2002, 2003. And then there was another, the MERS virus. Virus, the Middle East Respiratory Syndrome virus. This new virus, like those other rogue viruses, probably was first transmitted to humans from animals. What are the symptoms of coronavirus? So the symptoms resemble influenza. It's a respiratory virus initially. And so you have fever, not feeling very well, cough, and just feeling poorly. Is there a cure? We don't have a direct anti-coronavirus treatment. We can manage the patients through symptomatic care and supportive care, of course. And many patients already, the Chinese have said, have survived this infection. So how to stop this spread? Tell me right now, how do we stop this spread? How? The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention have this top of the mind. They have deployed over 100 people to New York, to San Francisco and Los Angeles. They will be screening people who are arriving from particularly Wuhan, China, to see whether they are sick. So there are laboratories around the world, including our own National Institutes of Health, that are now already working on developing a rapid diagnostic test. And the other thing they're doing is starting to work on a vaccine. The global community is really watching this with great care. And we in the United States definitely are on the alert and ready to respond. So what do Wuhan students have to say about this? Or Beijing students have to say about this? We thank the Almighty, like here in Beijing, the officials have told us that the stuff is, yeah, we heard that, I don't know, it's trying to spread around here, but they're trying their best and we foreigners and like those citizens in general, like we have been advised that we should stay inside and when we go out, like we should use masks and stuff like that. And we should avoid going places like crowded places, you know, stuff like that, yeah. And like everything is under control. All that I can tell people, I trust China, like they're in control of this thing. Like, don't be afraid. I think there's something they have to say there. There is something they have to say. Do you know it? Well, let's find out. I'm an international student studying in Wuhan. The situation here in Wuhan is quite delicate. Everybody is scared of this new virus. But the Chinese officials here, they have kind of kept us down. They told us everything is under control and they'll get to the bottom of it. They told us we should just be aware. Anywhere we go, we should wear our masks. Like if we're taking a bus or we're going shopping, like any other place we go to, we should wear masks. Because this new virus 
can be transferred through air through air so it's an airborne disease so they kind of they told us we should be wearing masks anywhere we go so to avoid getting it because the cure is not yet to be found so everybody here is panicking but they've ensured us they'll take care of it so thank you guys hope you guys have enjoyed this video make sure to give a like and uh, i want to give a special thanks to this channel that made it today oh my god keep this okay so i want to give thanks to these people actually who made this video happen very quickly it's the quick take by oh no thank you guys uh, actually this channel it's called uh quick take bloomberg yeah it's called quick take bloomberg they're the ones who made the answers so i'm really glad and if you guys don't know i'm gonna keep the link down in the description i hope they won't make us have some sort of corporate strike or copyright claim or something like that because we're just doing this for educative purpose so i hope you guys wait this is not supposed to end this way does it no it's not supposed to end this way boom so make sure you become a ninja right now as they you cover yourself everywhere and try to keep yourself uh closed anyway so as you have heard that's the best thing <coughs> are we affected See you next time. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you subscribe and see you next time. I started Africa to the world. Um, actually started last year September, but um, the way I started it, I think I failed from the beginning, and I didn't want to give up, so I continued again in um, what do you call it? Um, this year February, yeah. I started last year September, and I continued this year February.